Hey, my name is Christina, and I'm going to show you how to speed up or slow down a video using a free online tool called Kapwing. Since it's an online tool, you don't need to download anything, and you'll be able to access it on your phone. You might want to slow down a video to let your viewers see all the action that's happening really quickly. Or maybe you want to add weight. A slow motion video can really add a lot of drama to a scene. And you might want to speed up a video to quickly move through action or demonstrate a like, large spanning change of time. My goal with this video and all my videos is to give you more tools to help your creative process. So hit subscribe so you don't miss any awesome tips. First, I'm going to show you how to speed up or slow down a full video clip. And then after, I'll show you how to do just a section. First thing you need to do is head to Kapwing. So click on the link in the description or go to kapwing.com. Let's hit start editing. Now you need to upload your video file. You can do this without even logging in, but you will get a little watermark in the corner. And if you have a free account, you can upload a file up to 250 megabytes. You may need to resize your video just depending on what frame it is. Um, you can do that by just pulling these little tabs. The easiest way to change the speed of your video is by clicking on it and then going over here on the side panel and then saying minus to make it slower or plus to make it go a lot faster. <laughs> and if you need to trim it, you can click trim right here and this will let you cut off the heads and tails of your video. I don't need that right now. Go to settings. You don't want it to be a GIF, so it should just be set to default. And for video quality, if you wanted to maintain the high quality, say hi. Standard is really great if you're trying to upload this or share this video. Um, the video quality will still look the same, but it'll be a slightly smaller size. But I really want this one to maintain all the quality, so I'm gonna say hi. When I'm done, export depending on how large your file is. It may take just a minute or a couple minutes to export. When your video is all done, you can download it, go back and make edits, and get a shareable link so your friends can watch this video and download it themselves. Now I'll show you how to change the speed of just a section of the video. You're gonna need to go into the timeline. So click here on timeline, move your player head to where you want the change to start, select your clip and hit split, and then move forward to where you want it to end right around here, make sure my clip is selected, split. Kapwing is going to create new clips for each split section. So click on this one, go back to the main studio page, and then let's slow that down. We have to go back into the timeline and um, scoot this main clip down a little bit so that way it doesn't overlap. And then let's see what that looks like. Great. Audio is going to be distorted, so it might help to select this clip, go back into the main studio, and then lower the volume, so that way it's silent. Um, you, you know, it's sort of a stylistic choice, whatever you want. It's, sometimes it's jarring to have no sound underneath, but it's also kind of weird to have that super distorted sound. And when you're all done, click export. Ooh, this other video might be helpful for you to watch. Subscribe for more awesome content.